Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Windows 10 Update KB5006738 is now rolling out. It started rolling out yesterday on the 26th of October 2021, and I'm receiving my update today on the 27th in my part of the world. Now, this latest optional preview update is for Windows 10 versions 21H1, 20H2, and 2004. And the optional updates, the preview updates, which this update is, normally roll out near the end of every month. And um, they are non-security updates, which mainly carry bug fixes to the Windows 10 operating system. And if you don't install the optional updates at the end of every month, um, a lot of the bug fixes will be carried over into the next month's compulsory automatic patch Tuesday cumulative update. Now, this will also bump your version uh, build up after installing the update. If you're on 21H1 to 19043320, if you're on uh, 20H2, that'll be 19042.1320, and if you're on 2004, that'll be 19041.1320. Now, as always, if you'd like to see if you have the update, just head over to your settings, update and security. And you can see optional quality update available, cumulative update preview for Windows 10 versions, version 21H1 KB5006738. Now, as always, and I mention this every month with optional updates, only install this update if you are having problems. That's my suggestion. If you, are, if you are completely happy with your operating system, the way it's running and functioning, just leave the update alone. But if you are having bugs, you know, performance issues, memory issues, and some of the um, little uh, problems and bugs I'm going to mention now, then do yourself a favor and download and install the update. Now, some of the key highlights and bug fixes to the operating system now after applying this update, it will fix an issue that might prevent subtitles from displaying for certain video apps and streaming video sites. And according to Microsoft in the release notes, it also updates an issue that prevents Kana input mode users from inserting a question mark using the shift zero key combination. And then the last uh, major bug fix is it updates an issue that sometimes causes your lock screen background to appear black if you have set up a slideshow of pictures as your lock screen background. So as mentioned, this is a non-security update and includes a lot of quality improvements to the Windows 10 operating system. And then just uh, to mention some other um, kind of key bug changes and fixes uh, from the change log, is it also fixes an issue um, regarding the Windows 10 virtual private networks. If that was broken, uh, this update will also address that issue. And it also fixes an issue regarding your BitLocker recovery, and that, according to Microsoft, has also been addressed. And then another uh, key uh, bug fix here is it addresses a memory leak bug that uh, resulted in high memory usage in Windows 10. So if you've been having any performance issues, then maybe try and download the update to see if it uh, resolves that high memory usage in Windows 10. And then obviously, uh, you don't have to download the update using uh, Windows Update, you can go over to the Microsoft Update catalog, just enter the KB number, and you can also download it manually if, it, if you are having problems installing the update through Windows Update. So KB5006738 is now rolling out for those supported versions of Windows 10. And as I say, you don't have to install it. Um, and if you do, just go download and install. And then once that's done, restart your computer to apply the update. So I hope you found your this uh, video useful. Once again, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.